Hey, what is up guys? My name is Greg and welcome to this Minecraft build tutorial. On this episode, we're going to create a medieval style house. Now this style house dates back to early dates and one of my favorite parts of this build is the large archways in the front and sides of the house. And this medieval style house will look great in your Minecraft world. Now this build is broken down into six steps and without further ado, let's start the build. Also, this house is roughly 18 by 10 blocks wide and it is 14 blocks tall. And here's a complete list of the materials you'll need to build this house. Step 1. First let's create the base rectangle. We'll need 176 cobblestone blocks. First create a 16 long by 8 wide rectangle out of cobblestone blocks. Then we can raise the walls to a total of 4 blocks tall. Step 2. Next we can add in the roof. We'll need 288 spruce planks. On top of the cobblestone wall, add two spruce planks on top. And we can continue this to the other side. Then on the back side, add a placeholder block and place two spruce planks on top of this. Then we can remove the placeholder. Then we can continue this row to the other side. Then repeat by adding a placeholder to the back side and two spruce planks on top. Then remove the placeholder and continue the row to the other side. Then we can repeat this process one more time. And now we'll leave four roof sections that are two blocks tall apiece. Then let's repeat on the backside wall. To refresh, add two spruce planks on top of the cobblestone wall and continue to the other side. Then add a placeholder block on the backside. Then we can add two more blocks on top. Then we can continue to the other side. Then continue this pattern all the way up to the other roof line. Then at the ends of the house, we can fill in the sides with spruce planks. However, make sure to leave a 4 wide by 2 tall window opening. Then make a repeat on the other side as well. Step 3. Next let's work on the archways and trim. We'll need 38 stone brick blocks and 128 stone brick stairs. At the corner of the house, move over to the 5th space. Then place a stone brick block on the 5th space over. Then we can extend these stone brick blocks all the way up to the top of the first two spruce planks. Then from the other side of the house, move over to the 5th space as well. Place a stone brick column on the 5th space over and extend this column up to the top of the first two spruce planks. Then we could place a placeholder block on the inside. Then we can add two stone brick blocks on top. 
remove the placeholder below, then add another placeholder on the side, then two more blocks on top of that, remove the placeholder, then add another placeholder block to the side, and two more blocks on top. Then make your P on the other side. Then once the center archway is completed, we can work on the ends of the building. Add stone brick blocks along the edge of the house, and make sure to follow the same pattern as the roof line. Then once completed, we can add another stone archway, and start this one one space inwards. And make sure to follow the edge of the roof line. Then make a repeat on the other side. Then let's add stone brick stairs to the side of the fourth block up. And these stairs will act as trim all the way around the house. Step 4. Next is adding the doors and windows. We'll need 8 spruce fence posts, 2 oak doors, 12 iron trap doors, and 12 levers. At the middle stone archway, add in 2 oak doors. Then add spruce fence posts around the doors. Then we can remove 3 blocks on the sides. And 3 blocks on the other side as well. Then we can head inside. Next we can add in iron trap doors. Place these trap doors in the openings and levers up top. And these levers will help operate the iron trap doors. Then we can repeat on the other side. Next remove three blocks from the back wall and add iron trap doors and levers up top. Then repeat this for the other back corner as well. Step 5. Next let's install the interior floors and walls. We will need 86 spruce planks, 82 stone brick blocks, 14 stone brick stairs, 2 doors, and 16 wooden trap doors. Inside the house, replace the grass with spruce planks. Then we can add in the second level at the fourth block up. And add stone brick blocks that extend out four blocks wide.
Then under the fourth stone brick block, we can add in a wall that extends downwards. Then we can add a staircase along the side and space the staircase one space back. Then let's repeat for the other side of the house. To refresh, add stone brick blocks in the fourth block up and extend out four blocks wide. Then we can extend downwards and add in a wall. Next, we can add in a staircase along the side. Next, we can add in upside down stairs under the stairways. And this will help provide extra detail. Also add in doors under here as well. And these will lead into the bottom rooms. Then lastly, to finish this step, I'm going to add in wooden trap doors along the window openings. And we can add in these oak trap doors on both sides of the house. Now you can always replace this with glass if you prefer, or a spruce fence post. Step 6. Lastly is the interior, and I'll leave this completely up to you. However, I'll quickly show you a walkthrough of how I did mine. Thanks for watching guys and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions about the build or would like to leave some feedback, I'd love to hear it. Also, make sure to subscribe because I create build tutorials just like this one every week. I'll catch you in the next one. Later guys. Want more building tutorials? I have many other playlists that might interest you on my channel. Make sure to check them out.